Thank you. If it's alright, I wanna kick it with you all night, all night. Hi everyone, welcome back to my booktube channel. My name is Brenna Green. You're watching Pineapple Strawberry. This is my little sister Skylar. So if you see her in and out of the video, she's a busy kid. But today I'm gonna be giving you guys my statistics for 2017 reading and then my 2018 goals. So yeah, I know we're like 10 days in, no, nine days into January. You okay? Okay, she's back up. Better late than never. Alright, so um, in 2017 I read 36 books and 13,474 pages and by the way, I'm getting this all off of Goodreads and Goodreads has like really nice statistics if you want to see like your year in review and stuff. The shortest book I read was Bambert's Book of Missing Stories which was 128 pages and the longest book I read was Winter by Marissa Meyer and that was 827 pages. I've never read anything that big before and I was actually really accomplished with that. The average length of all the books that I read was uh, 421 pages. The most popular book I read was Miss Peregrine's Home for Peculiar Children. That was also read by 784,212 people. Whereas the least popular book was Bambert's Book of Missing Stories, and that was read by 257 people. Let me fix this camera. I mean, I'm, I'm filming with my phone, so. Right. My average rating for 2017 was 4.4 4 stars. Quality wise, it was an amazing year for me. I'm so proud that I read a lot of 5 star books and 4 star books. I think my lowest rating on a book was 3 stars in 2017. As I said, I'm not going to waste my time on a bad book. The highest rated on Goodreads book was The House of Hades with a 4.55 average. That was a good, good, good book. And my first review of the year was The Blood of Olympus. And I said, wow, that finale was absolutely amazing. And it was. It was a really, really good finale. My last review of the year was Heartless by Marissa Meyer, and I gave it five stars. I said, damn, haven't read a book this good in a while. Freaking loved it. My Goodreads goal for 2018, I put as 15 books, even though I'd really, really like to read more books than I did last year, this year. I put it as 15 because I don't want to stress myself out. I don't know how busy I'm going to be this uh, this year because I just started a new job and I'm going back to college soon. Another uh, goal that I have this year is to read more middle grade. I really like those kind of books because they're really really lighthearted. Do you guys know any middle grade books that are like super super good? Then let me know in the comments. Also, I heard about Cozy Mysteries. So it's like a mystery book but it's like funny. It has a little bit of humor to it. So if you guys know any Cozy Mysteries then I would be so down to read those. It would be my first try at them. I would also really like to participate in like a readathon this year or maybe a 24 hour readathon which would be really really cool. So I'm going to be focusing on booktube a lot this year and reading and like participating more as a viewer, as a creator and it's gonna be a good year for reading i can already tell thank you guys so much for watching let me know in the comments down below a goal you guys want to accomplish in the year 2018 for your reading and i'll catch you guys in the next one Peace. i talk gray i don't keep it white and black only say i love you just so i can hear it back sometimes